everybody, Rob here from Plymouth Music Zone. Hope you're well, hope everything's good. Uh, so last week I phased a ruler sound when we, we were um, making it do that thing that you can do with a table and a ruler. And when I was putting it together, I ended up doing four phases because two didn't sound interesting to me and that gave me an idea. Uh, so this week I've kind of built up on that idea and it's it's an interesting um, thing I've learned recently about psychology is that you we don't just I don't know we've got this like image of somebody I don't know doing a composition or something and they're just like thinking all internally and then writing the notes down or thinking coming up with an idea and writing it down but actually doing things physically so the act of making that ruler video that can help bring ideas about and this is one example of that happening so uh yeah slight tangent there thinking about thinking about thinking uh but sometimes you can you can make cool discoveries by doing uh so yeah certainly something i've um done a lot of is uh, just believing that it should all be internal thought when actually, yes, um, actions can lead to thoughts and ideas. I uh, see. So yeah, what I've done is I've taken a famous, uh, a common bell pattern from African music, which goes dum 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 dum, and the the mnemonic I learned for that is beat. This rhythm ends on the, and then when you play it as a loop, it goes. Beat this rhythm ends on the beat. This rhythm ends on the beat, and so forth. And it's a fascinating rhythm because it's often written down in twelve, and it has loads of different sort of symmetries you can put over it. You can feel a three pulse through it, or a four, or six, or a two. Like, and there's so much variation. So I thought I'd assign it. I put it into a MIDI sequence and assign a different note uh, on a scale for each. Uh, I did end up using an octave somewhere, but or two places, but yeah. So I've assigned a different note to each pulse of that, that famous bell pattern. And then I've phased it six times this time. Uh, and I just hope you like it. Um, but it's just, yeah, hopefully just an example of something interesting coming about pretty much by accident. Um, so yeah, I've put the whole phase in this time, it lasts about five minutes, and I just hope you enjoy listening to the sort of chaos emerging, and then sort of mo like this kind of like clarity comes about as, as certain of the six phases end up together. But yeah, uh, here it is. Enjoy, and see you next time. Bye. <laughs> Thank you. 